then comes our uh, next topic which is ectro entropy on its invert turning of eyelid uh, margin uh, leading to rubbing of the eyelashes on the cornea which are falling types involutional it's more common in the lower lid uh, due to thinning of tarsus uh, laxity of the uh, canthal tendons and weakness of the lower lid retractors the surgery for correction or a transverse lid sutures modified wheeler's operation v's procedure lester jones procedure for severe and recurrent cases all these names you just have to remember cicatricial uh, is a uh, more common on the upper lid due to scarring of the palpebral conjunctiva uh, the cause are trachoma herpes steven johnson ocular cicatricial pemphigoid chemicals and th thermal burns the surgery is where uh, which is very important is uh, basically uh, tarsal fracture uh, mucous membrane grafting wedge resection can also be done congenital is basically uh, it's more commonly seen in the lower lid it usually resolves in 1 to 2 years acute spastic is due to spasm of the orbicularis Mm, in essential blepharospasm then comes the ectropion it's the outward turning of the lid margin it causes epiphora obviously because of the lid margin is out there will be lot of watering the different types are involutional it affects the lower lid it causes by the weakness of the orbicularis muscle and laxity of the medial and lateral canthal tendon the surgeries include uh, a ziegler uh, cautery uh, medial conjunctivoplasty lazy t procedure modified kunt procedure so all these things you just have to know paralactic ectropion is basically facial nerve palsy may lead to exposure keratopathy uh, basically we do uh, uh, lubricant eye drops we give lubricant eye drops and i already showed you tarsorophy where we suture the eyelids or we do medial canthoplasty as you can see here medial canthoplasty is being done for this ectropion condition then is the uh, other uh, lid condition such as trichiasis inward turning or mixed action of eyelashes which rub on the surface of the cornea treatment includes epilation electrolysis cryotherapy all these things dystrichiasis presence of second row of eyelash along the opening of the meibomian gland treatment is required only if the lash rub disturbs the cornea treatment same as trichiasis the same thing epilation all those procedures trichomegaly increase in the length of eyelashes it's called trichomegaly drug induced phenytoin topical uh, prostaglandin analogs sometimes topical prostaglandin analogs are used for um, cosmetic uh, thing where uh, the eyelashes grow so there will be a uh, trichomegaly and phenytoin as you know it causes hirsutism and uh, trichomegaly also the uh, other conditions are not that important cyclosporin malnutrition aids uh, forfaria all these things hermancy podlac all these things are not that important but it's good to know metamorphosis loss of eyelashes Uh, chronic anterior blepharitis causes metamorphosis as i already told you infiltrating lid tumors burns radiotherapy of uh, and chemotherapy leprosy leprosy is the most common uh, cause that they can ask you leprosy causes what condition that is metamorphosis mixed edema sle generalized alopecia and psoriasis the next is a uh, polyosis which is basically whitening of eyelashes uh, the conditions include uh, chronic anterior blepharitis sympathetic ophthalmitis vitiligo Uh, vitiligo as you know it's whitish in color vok koinagi harada which is very important condition which we'll talk about it in ubia and vok koinagi harada wherever that name comes uh, sympathetic ophthalmitis follows it and then there's something called uh, wardenburg uh, wardenburg syndrome tubercular uh, tuberous sclerosis albinism and uh, marfan syndrome causes of retract retraction include uh, thyroid eye disease contralateral ptosis upper lid scarring surgical overcorrection of ptosis uh, third nerve misdirection duans Uh, perinodes syndrome infantile hydrocephalus all these things can cause lid retraction